Marriage does not come without its struggles. While on your wedding day, you are sure that the relationship is meant to be, sometimes in time, you start to doubt whether or not this is still the case. As you embrace married life, circumstances change and life can get in the way of giving sufficient time to your relationship. Before we continue, please take some time to subscribe to Daily Dose, like, and share this video with your friends. One woman decided to do something about this doubt she was feeling. She wanted to see proof from her husband that he really still loved her. However, unfortunately, her plan completely backfired and the poor woman was absolutely terrified. When couples get together, they often know pretty soon that they share a special bond with one another. However, it takes work to ensure that the bond remains. Both of you have to put in a significant amount of time and effort to keep it there. One woman was feeling especially uneasy about her relationship. She decided that something had to be done in order to put her mind at ease. She came up with a plan to test her husband's loyalty. The plan involved hiding under the bed to hear his reaction to a bizarre prank. She soon realized that this definitely wasn't the right way to go about finding out his true feelings. The husband and wife in question had been happily married for years. However, several years down the line, the wife started to feel that her husband was distancing himself from her. She was convinced that he had stopped loving her. The thought of this broke her heart. She had to do something about it. After brainstorming some ideas, the wife settled on a plan. She wanted to see some proof that he still loved her and thought up an elaborate prank for this purpose. She used all the details of their life thus far in order to find out what his true feelings were. The results left her totally speechless. She couldn't have planned her prank at a better time since at this point in time, her husband seemed to be distancing himself more than ever. Her mind was constantly filled with potential scenarios and reasons why he might be behaving in this way. Was her husband having an affair with another woman or maybe he had an addiction that he was choosing to hide from her because she might not be happy with it? The wife couldn't handle having these thoughts running through her mind all the time. She was determined to find out the truth. After contemplating several options, the woman decided to write a note to her husband. In the note, she wrote out all of the details of their marriage in the hope of find out at what point things had gone so wrong for them or whether she had done something to cause her husband to distance himself from her. She still loved her husband with all her heart, but she didn't feel like she could trust him anymore. She needed to know that he still felt the same way. If he didn't and he was just pretending, then he was wasting both his own time and hers. She needed to know. In order to find out whether her husband still truly loved her, this cunning wife decided to threaten her husband with a divorce. At the end of the letter she had written, detailing every part of their relationship, she wrote that she wanted a divorce. Her intention was to scare him and to see what his reaction to this would be. She would analyze his reaction and draw a conclusion from that as to whether or not he still loved her. It was a genius plan. However, the plan was not about to go as smoothly as she'd expected. The wife wanted to be there when her husband opened the letter, but without him knowing. She decided to hide underneath the bed and place the letter on top of the bed so that he would definitely see it. This way she would be able to see his reaction and know how he really felt. She felt that this was the only way that she could get a sincere reaction out of him. Her only worry now was that her husband might catch on to what she was trying to do and realize that her request for a divorce wasn't at all genuine. Her plan was very straightforward. She would remain under the bed until her husband had read the letter. As soon as she heard him start to express any emotion as a result of his heartbreak, whether through tears or frustration, she would reveal herself. This would reassure her that their marriage was still strong and that she actually had nothing to worry about. She would come out from under the bed and comfort her upset husband. However, she did not get the reaction she had hoped for. Her husband did not cry at the note. His response will shock you. The letter explained that the wife thought that the love in their relationship seemed to have faded and that at this point she felt that their marriage was non-existent. She had to write this in as blunt a way as possible in order to properly get through to her husband. Once she had finished the letter and was happy with what she had written, she placed it on top of the bed and took up her position underneath the bed. She was ready to discover the truth once and for all. However, this was about to become one of the worst decisions she had ever made. 
She waited under the bed, anxiously anticipating her husband's return. She was there waiting for a long time, meaning she had plenty of time to mull her plan over. This wasn't a good thing, as it meant that she began to overthink everything. Perhaps this wasn't the right way to go about the situation. What if he didn't react in the way she hoped he would? Would he be angry that she had done this to him? Or would he be understanding? It wouldn't be long before she would have answers to the questions that plagued her mind. They wouldn't be quite what she had expected. As the time passed and her husband hadn't yet returned home, the woman was growing more and more anxious and afraid of what the result would be. Soon she heard him arrive home, enter the house, and walk upstairs towards the bedroom. Her husband knew that she was home, but he certainly wouldn't be expecting to find this note in her place. This would come as a shock to him. Of course, the letter being unexpected would mean that his reaction would be more genuine. When her husband finally entered the bedroom, she heard him stop and pick up the note. A silence followed as he read it through. She knew it was definitely him, as she could see his feet from her position underneath the bed. The tension was rising. While he was reading the letter, she was completely frozen with fear. From this moment on, anything could happen. This might be the moment that ends her marriage. She couldn't handle the suspense of waiting for his reaction. So what happened next? When her husband reached the end of the letter, he burst out laughing. He then proceeded to take his phone out of his pocket and make a call to his friend. His wife, still listening intently, heard everything that he said to whoever he was on the phone to. My marriage is finally over. I'll see you in a minute, were his exact words. After he had put the phone down, he hurriedly walked out of the room. His wife was in a state of total shock. She couldn't quite believe what had just happened. The phone call that her husband had made left her in a serious state of shock. Not only was he happy to finish with her and end the marriage, but he evidently had someone who he had been confiding in about it all. Who was this mysterious person? Her mind was racing with potential people it could have been. Maybe he had a mistress, or was it just one of his buddies? She hoped with all her heart that it was the latter. When you discover the real answer, it might entertain you. The woman was reduced to tears. She lay beneath the bed sobbing and wondering what this would all result in. Was she really about to get a divorce? She thought to herself. At least she knew the truth now. As difficult as that truth might be for her to take, she was so hoping that upon reading the note, her husband would display some intense emotion and heartbreak and tell her that he was sorry for being distant and that he really loved her. Sadly, this was not the case. Now it was time to pay the price for her actions. She knew that she now had to deal with much more than what she had previously thought. Just like that, her life had completely changed. Not only did her husband seem to be happy to be rid of her, but he was potentially in another relationship. The thought of this made her feel sick to her stomach. She felt as though her heart had been torn apart. After years of being happily married, was he really capable of doing something like this to her? Was this all really true? It couldn't be. The woman wasn't sure what her next move would be. She came out from underneath the bed, tears still rolling down her face. How would she rebuild her life on her own? She couldn't stand the thought of doing life without her husband. As she came out from under the bed, something immediately caught her eye. On the bed, next to her own letter, was another letter. In the time that her husband was still in the bedroom, he must have written a letter for her to read. This is where the story gets even more interesting. The woman couldn't have been more upset after everything that had happened. She felt absolutely heartbroken. With tears still streaming down her face, she picked up the note, her hands trembling in fear at what it might say. Was her life about to change drastically? After pausing for a moment, she eventually plucked up the courage to read it. She got as far as reading the words, Dear Wife, and then stopped. She couldn't bring herself to read the rest of the letter. She was crying too much, and her vision was blurred. The letter that her husband had written was short and the woman felt that she knew, without looking at it, exactly what it would say. If he was so happy about his marriage ending, then it was unsurprising that he didn't have much to say. Whatever it was that her husband had written, it only took up a few sentences on the page. Compared to the length of the letter she had written to him, it was nothing. Whatever he had written must have been very much to the point. What did the letter say? After plucking up the courage to finally read the letter, she was very shocked by what she saw. But this time, she was shocked in a good way. 
It was quite the opposite of what she had expected to read. Things were finally beginning to look up. The letter read, Dear wife, next time you try to trick me into proving my love, make sure your feet aren't sticking out from underneath the bed. Oh, dear. Her plan had been foiled. Would she ever be able to live this down, she wondered? Despite the weeks of planning that had gone into this little prank, she managed to ruin it in the most careless way. She didn't even consider the fact that he might notice her feet under the bed. She was far more concerned with how he would react to the letter. It had totally slipped her mind to check that she was totally under her bed before her husband walked into the room. This mistake gave her husband a chance to prove, not necessarily his love, but the fact that he could take a joke and take it very well. This is certainly a very good trait. Would his wife ever be able to get over her embarrassment? Having put the pieces of the story together, the woman was able to come to the conclusion that her husband's phone call had been fake. His laughter hadn't been at all genuine, and her marriage most certainly wasn't over. At least she hoped it wasn't. She had learned a valuable lesson in the importance of not messing with other people's emotions. If the roles had been reversed, she probably wouldn't have appreciated it too much. It is unlikely that anyone would. Could her husband forgive her for what she had done? It shouldn't take an elaborate prank like that to find out whether or not your partner still truly loves you. You should really just know. This isn't always the case, however. If you are worried, all it takes is to have an open and honest conversation with your other half. This is something that this woman realized after her scheme didn't go quite as she had planned. Fortunately, this incident didn't end their marriage, but did the couple stay together? We wonder whether you could easily get past something like that. While the woman didn't get the reaction she had anticipated and hoped for, the prank did, in fact, end up making their relationship stronger. It meant that they were able to have a completely honest conversation and she was able to open up to her husband about everything she had been feeling leading up to this point. Trust and openness are, without a doubt, two of the most important elements to a relationship. They are the foundation for a healthy relationship. Without them, a relationship cannot be successful. This story above all else, underlines the danger of not speaking up when you are worried about something. We are so glad that the final result was a positive one for these two.